There's a light side, a good side, and then there's a, a bad side, a dark side. In hacking, it's the same thing. You're gonna be a Jedi or you're gonna be a Sith. Anybody see the latest movie? I thought it was okay. The skills you learn to become a hacker, whether you're good or bad, will be pretty much the same. You're gonna have kind of the same skill set, but it's what you do with that skill set that makes you a white hat hacker, a hacker for good, and then a black hat hacker, an evil nefarious hacker. But what, what makes a good and bad hacker? Let's talk about the bad guys first. The guys you see typically wearing masks like this. This is the anonymous mask, right? Or someone will yell at me. It's actually the Guy Fox mask. I got that. But it's people who hack companies to steal data and then sell that data like on the dark web or something. They're trying to benefit financially from their, their hacking or to cause harm or to bring down governments. Like what? It's nefarious. But on the flip side, the white hat hackers the guys who may not, you know, wear the mask, they, they don't wear a mask. They say, hey, I'm a hacker, but I'm, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to help you. So companies like companies I've worked for where I will build up my security and make sure my network is awesome. I think it's awesome, right? Like I think no one's getting in here, but do I actually know? How can I test this? That's where a white hat ethical hacker comes in. I will hire an ethical hacker. Say, hey, Mr. Hacker, good hacker. Are you a Jedi? Okay. Um, Come try to break into my network and see if you can get in. So the ethical hacker will come in with his hacking skills and try to penetrate my network. It's often called a penetration tester. They see if they can get into your network or get into your systems, find vulnerabilities. Now, if they were a black hat hacker, they would find vulnerabilities and then steal data and then run away. But a white hat hacker will go, oh, no, 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 I found some problems for you. Let me tell you about it. And uh, so they'll you know, make a report saying, oh, I, I, I got in this way. You had an exposed port here. Like just there's all these vulnerabilities on a network. They'll type it up, hand it to you and say, here is what I found. And then they may even say, here's how you can fix it. See, and it really it's the same skill set a black hat hacker would have. They're just using their, their hacking skills for good, which is the only way I can advise you to do this. Now, it, it does sound cool to be a black hat hacker, you know, but it's it's stealing, it's, it's theft, it's bad. Like go to jail bad, go to jail for a long time bad, you know?